Hi everyone. This video is for educational purposes only. On this video we will gonna talk about lunar meteorites. These extraterrestrial specimens have traveled thousands or millions of miles or more to reach us, arriving from a place we can only dream of visiting, the moon itself. Their discovery and study have provided unprecedented insight into the geology, composition, and history of our closest celestial neighbor. From their mysterious origins to the unique features that set them apart from other types of meteorites, there is much to learn and discover about these spectacular lunar rocks. So, what is a lunar meteorite? Lunar meteorites, or lunates, are meteorites from the moon. In other words, they are rocks found on Earth that were ejected from the moon by the impact of an asteroidal meteorite or possibly a comet. How did lunar meteorites get here? Because the moon has no atmosphere to stop them, meteoroids strike the moon every day. Lunar escape velocity averages 2.38 kilometers per second, 1.48 miles per second, only a few times the muzzle velocity of a common rifle, 0.7 to 1.0 kilometers per second. Any rock on the lunar surface that is accelerated by the impact of a meteoroid to lunar escape velocity or greater will leave the moon's gravitational influence. Most rocks ejected from the moon become captured by the gravitational field of either the Earth or the Sun and go into orbit around those bodies. Over a period of a few years to tens of thousands of years, those orbiting the Earth eventually fall to Earth. Those in orbit around the Sun may also eventually strike the Earth up to a few tens of millions of years after they were launched from the Moon. The first lunar meteorite to be found appears to be Yamato 791197, on the 20th of November 1979. However, it is not known when Kalkalon Creek was found. The meteoritical bulletin states, after 1960, but it was not recognized to be of lunar origin until 1990, so it may well have been collected earlier than Yamato 791197. And here are some lunar meteorite sample that I will show you so you had the idea or a reference of a lunar meteorite look like. Allen Hills 81005, Location, Allen Hills, Transantarctic Mountains, Antarctica. Found. 1982 January 18th Mass, 31.4 grams, one piece, classification, anorthositic breccia. Physical description. This is an unusual looking sample. Flow marks are apparent on the exterior which is covered with a pitted, glassy, greenish tan colored crust. Immediately underneath this crust, the surface is a dusty, gray color. The interior consists of abundant angular clasts, which range in color from gray to white, set in a black matrix. The size of the clasts are as small as submillimeter and as large as 8 millimeters in diameter. The sample is very coherent. Some areas of oxidation were noted. Dimensions. 3 by 2.5 by 3 centimeters. Yamato 791197. Location. Yamato Mountains, Antarctica. Found. 1979 November 20th Mass, 52.4 grams, 1 piece, classification, feldspathic regolith breccia. Y791197 is a polymic microbreccia containing clasts in a dark brown glassy matrix, similar to lunar anorthositic regolith breccias. Two or more types of clasts are observed in the thin section, such as polymineralic, monomineralic and melt clasts. Most of larger clasts are polymineralic, frequently composed of calcic plagioclase, olivine, and pyroxene, less commonly plagioclases, or plagioclases alone. Calcalong Creek Location, Waluna District, Western Australia, Australia. Found. After 1960 Mass, 19 grams, one piece. History. A stone of 19 grams was found by an Aborigine meteorite hunter in the Milbilili strewn field. Physical characteristics. It has a complete fusion crust, the interior shows a microbreccia with white angular clasts in a dark matrix, impact melt breccia, calculated from the bulk analysis, 50% anorthosite, 20% creep, 15% Luna 16 type low T mare basalt and 15% SCCRV components. Shizer 166, location, Zufar, Oman found, the 10th of April 2008. Mass. 128.8 grams, one piece, classification, lunar, feldspathic melt breccia. History. One stone was found by Luke Leben in the desert at night. Physical characteristics. The 128.8 grams meteorite lacks an obvious fusion crust. The interior consists of a gray, 
vesicular up to 1.2 mm vesicles, melt matrix with rounded clasts stained red by hematite. Many vesicles are filled with terrestrial alteration products, including calcite, CA sulfate, and celestite. Specimens. 20.1 grams are on deposit at WUSL, the main mass is held by Leben. Queen Alexandra range 93,069 and 94,269, location, Queen Alexandra Range, Transantarctic Mountains, Antarctica. Dimensions, CM, 5.0 by 2.2 by 2.3 mass, 21.4 grams, one piece. Meteorite type, Lunar Anorthocytic Breccia. Macroscopic description, Cecilia Satterwhite and Marilyn Lindstrom. The overall shape of this lunar meteorite is approximately one-third of a flat ovoid. Thick gray-green frothy fusion crust covers the top while thin granular medium olive-green-brown fusion crust covers the bottom. The north face is a fractured surface with exposed interior matrix and abundant fractures. This surface consists of black matrix with abundant millimeter-sized white-gray clasts. Some clasts have weathered to a yellowish color. The meteorite is an anorthocytic microbreccia, presumably of lunar origin. In thin section, it is very similar to MAC 88105. Antarctic Meteorite Newsletter 12, 2, 1989. Pecora Escarpment 02007, Location, Transantarctic Mountains, Antarctica. Field No. 13690, Dimensions, CM, 4.0 x 3.5 x 1.0, Mass, 22.372 grams, One Piece. Classification, Lunar Basaltic Breccia, Macroscopic Description, Kathleen McBride. This is a disc-shaped meteorite with brown exterior on the top portion of the rock. The bottom face has tan-colored, ropey glass with a frothy appearance. Polygonal fractures and various clasts of different sizes, shapes and colors can be seen. The interior is composed of a hard, dark gray matrix with white clasts. Underneath the tan ropey glass is a layer of shiny green glass. Kalahari 008 and 009. Location, Kalahari, Botswana. Found, 1999 September. Mass. 598 grams, one piece, classification, lunar meteorite, feldspathic regolith breccia. A single stone of 598 grams was found in September 1999 by an anonymous finder in front of a sand dune within the Kalahari Desert. The rock is an anorthocytic breccia having typical clasts of lunar highland breccias, e.g., feldspathic crystalline melt breccias, granulitic lithologies, cataclastic anorthocytes etc., embedded within a well-lithified matrix. An impact melt spherule indicates that this rock derives from the regolith. The regolith origin is also supported by the finding of solar wind implanted rare gases, L. Schultz, mines. McAlpine Hills 88104 and 88105 Location, McAlpine Hills, Transantarctic Mountains, Antarctica. Meteorite type. Anorthocytic breccia. Macroscopic description. Roberta score. MAC 88104 and MAC 88105 are paired fragments of a polymic breccia. Both specimens have thin gray-green fusion crust which covers approximately 30% of the exterior surface. The other exterior surfaces are dark gray and weathered, with numerous clasts and bugs where clasts have been plucked out by weathering. The largest clast exposed, 1.5 by 1 cm, is fine-grained and anorthocytic, with scattered mafique minerals. Other clasts are medium-grained and more mafique. Northwest Africa 2995 Clan, Location, Algeria, Found, 2005. Mass. 538 grams, one piece, classification, achondrite, lunar feldspathic breccia. History. A 538 grams, fully crusted and minimally weathered stone was purchased in Morocco by A. Aronson in November 2005. Classification. Achondrite, lunar feldspathic breccia. Specimens. A 21.2 gram specimen is on deposit at now. Aronson holds the main mass. Northwest Africa 5000, location, Morocco. Find, 2007 July. Mass. 11,528 grams, one piece, classification, achondrite, lunar, feldspathic breccia. History. 
found in July 2007 in southern Morocco and provided to Adam Huppe in October 2007 by a Moroccan dealer. Physical Characteristics A single, large cuboidal stone, 11.528 kg, with approximate dimensions 27 cm x 24 cm x 20 cm. One side, which appears to have been embedded downward in light brown mud, has preserved regmoglyphs and is partially covered by translucent, pale greenish fusion crust with fine contraction cracks. Abundant large beige to white, coarse-grained clasts up to 8 cm across, some of which have been eroded out on exterior surfaces of the stone, likely by Aeolian sand blasting, and sparse black, vitreous clasts up to 2 cm across, containing irregular small white inclusions, are set in a dark gray to black, partially glassy breccia matrix. One partially eroded clast exposed on an exterior surface contains both the coarse-grained beige lithology and the more resistant black, vitreous lithology in sharp contact. Classification. A chondrite, lunar, feldspathic breccia, specimens, a total of 40.2 grams of sample, two polished mounts and one large polished thin section are on deposit at UWS. Sai al uhaimir 169, location, Oman, found, 2002 January 16. Mass. 206.45 grams, one piece, classification, lunar meteorite, creep rich mafik impact melt breccia and adhering regolith. History. A complete, light gray greenish rounded stone, 70 by 43 by 40 millimeters, weighing 206.45 grams was found in the Sai al uhaimir region of Oman. Northwest Africa 7022, location, Algeria, purchased, 2011 March. Mass. 466 grams, one piece, history, reported to be found near Tanduf, Algeria, in February 2011, and purchased from a dealer in Zagora, Morocco by Peter Udas in March 2011. Physical characteristics. A single stone, 466 grams, with partial fusion crust, about two-thirds of the stone consists of a fragmental breccia composed of a variety of lighter colored, mostly angular mineral and rock clasts in a dark gray matrix. The other one-third of the stone is comprised of a single large, to four centimeters, light gray, fine-grained clast, which itself contains small remnant clasts. Classification. A chondrite, lunar, feldspathic breccia, terrestrial weathering is minimal. Specimens. A total of 21.6 grams of sample is on deposit at UWS. The main mass is held by Peter Udas. Northwest Africa 3163 clan, location, Mauritania or Algeria. Fine. 2005 August. Mass, 1634 grams, one piece, classification. A chondrite, lunar, feldspathic granulitic impact type. History. In August 2005, G. Huppe purchased a 1,634 gram stone from a Moroccan dealer in Warzazate. Classification. A chondrite, lunar, feldspathic granulitic impact type. Specimens. A 20.1 grams type specimen and one polished thin section are on deposit at UWS. G. Huppe holds the main mass. Graves Nunadix 06157, GRA 06157, location. Graves Nunatix, Antarctica. Field No. 17724 dimensions, cm, 1.0 by 1.0 by 0.5 mass, 0.788 grams, one piece. Classification. Lunar anorthositic breccia. Macroscopic description, Kathleen McBride. The exterior has no fusion crust and is a gray color with white and cream colored clasts. The interior is a gray matrix with white clasts throughout. Dar al Ghani 262. Location, Al Jufra, Libya found, 1997 March 23rd. Mass. 513 grams, one piece, classification, lunar, anorthositic breccia. History. A single 513 gram stone was found in the Sahara. Classification and description contains clasts up to 1 cm mainly anorthositic lithologies and crystalline impact melt breccias, and glass fragments and spherules, partially devitrified, embedded in a fine-grained, well-consolidated matrix, bulk plagioclase, and greater than 95. Olivine, Fa20-71, low Ca pyroxene, Fs26-63, has shock veins, 
contains metal particles, 5 to 26 WT% Ni, ilmenite, troilite, TCR spinel, meteorite is moderately weathered. Specimens. Type specimen several grams plus two thin sections. Through the study of lunar meteorites, scientists are continually gaining insights into the nature and history of the moon. Thank you for watching. Please like share and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos.